Hey folks, in this short video, I'm going to open up a, a set of four watches I bought off eBay. So let's see what we have. They should be four Casios. Uh, I believe all four should work. Yes, here we go. Paid about $11.70 for all four of these, including shipping. I think it was four dollars for shipping. Hey, I get some free rubber bands too. Should be two fifty nine W's, which I've never had or really seen before, and two others that I don't know the model of. Okay, and here they are. Nice, nice packing, that's for sure. Let's take a look at this one first. That looks like the most modern one of the bunch, probably. Has no, no strap. Let's see if we can get a little bit closer. It's actually a pretty nice looking watch. And the case has like, looks like no scratches at all. That's pretty cool. Oh, I probably could have read it right on the screen here, sure. A one seventy eight W. Cool. Alright, so A one seventy eight W. I don't know anything about this watch. Looks like it does some some lighting. Cool. Cool. Actually I like that. It's too bad it doesn't have its strap. Bracelet, whatever. That almost is it? Just a nice looking watch on its own. All right. Originally, these are intended for kind of a project I have, but who knows? Maybe I'll mix and match. As you can see, I have quite a bunch of watches. Here's one of the 59Ws, I believe they're called. All right. So what does that say? Can't W5... Yep. W59. W59. Made in China. It seems to be in pretty nice condition too. Not too bad. I like it. Let's put it on. Hmm, the strap is much less flexible than my uh than my 91W. It's much harder. I don't think I like it quite as much, but hey, it looks pretty cool. Looks good. And the date is right. Cool. All right, let's go to the next watch. I'm just kind of randomly grabbing these out. Let's, you know, let's actually grab the other one that should be about the same. Interestingly, right away I can tell this, this, uh, this band is much more flexible. It looks about the same otherwise. I wonder if this is a replacement because this one is shinier. I bet this is like some kind of replacement strap. This one's much more glossy and much harder. The flexibility is hugely different. You know, so I'm guessing this will be much more comfortable. Okay, here's the one I just picked out though. Oh wow, it's much easier to read. 59 w, w 59 you know i wonder if this is even a real one i wonder if this could be like a, a knockoff or something i know one thing i've seen that you can kind of guess if they're real or not is the viewing angle i don't know i don't see any huge difference but um okay anyway they both look okay they both seem to work fine but it is interesting this one on the on the right is much easier to read on the back and it's also different looking. Hmm. Okay, anyway, moving on to the last watch. Now this one I think looked kind of cheesy. I don't know, it kind of doesn't look that great. Oh, it's smaller than I expected, which is actually a good thing. I guess this is some kind of lady's watch being all pink. 
Um, it has like the, the, the band can't move out, you know, it's kind of fixed. In fact, it's really fixed. It can't even go in. Uh, let's take a look at the back. Oh, is this even a Casio? I thought that, I thought the ad said four Casios. Maybe I'm mistaken. This is some other brand, maybe. Let me take a closer look. Yeah, I don't even think this is a Casio. It, it says some kind of build numbers and so forth. You can probably make them out pretty well right there. Um, but I don't see mentioned Casio anywhere. It seems to be more or less a, a no, a no name brand or a no brand. But anyway, it might work for the project that I'm doing. I think it will, in fact. So cool. Well, that's what I got. Four watches for just under $12. Let me know in the comments what you think. Did I get a, a fair deal? Or uh, is that a normal deal? Or is that a good deal? I think that's a pretty good deal. 12 for all, that's uh, about 3 bucks each. Three, yeah, it's less than $3 a piece. Come on, you can't beat that. I'm curious about this one. What do you guys think? Is that a real one or is it some kind of knockoff? I'm going to look more closely once I shut the camera off. But uh, that's interesting. It doesn't matter for what I'm doing. I think it'll be totally fine, but nice. All right. Thanks, everybody, for watching. Let me know if you like these type of videos, and we'll do some more.